Hi there, it's Ellie here and um, just thought I'd do another video. I am in a place today called, let me think, Banna Strand. Banna, yes, Banna Strand. And um, that's just outside Trilly. And uh, had a bit of a bit of a crazy day. Well, past the past couple of days really have been kind of weird and intense. <laughs> and I don't know whether it was just because I was in a bit of a funny mood or whether I was in a funny mood because the the days were kind of a bit strange. But uh, yeah, I uh, decided to drive round the Ring of Kerry, which, hmm, well, it's about 100 miles, really, driving right round um, one of the peninsulas. And I've heard, well, I've heard all sorts of things about it, really. There's this kind of idea, I suppose, that it is absolutely amazing and, you know, you have to do the Ring of Kerry and all this sort of stuff. So whenever I was here, <laughs> just, you know, um, just round the corner from it, I thought, right, okay, let's go and do, have to go and do the Ring of Kerry, of course. And I don't know what to say, really. It felt like, it felt like a waste of, of a day, really. Um, like, you know, a hundred miles, basically. It's a, you know, it's a lot of driving and don't get me wrong, there were some really, really pretty parts, but I think I had it in my head that it was supposed to be like really, like extraordinarily beautiful. And it wasn't. <laughs> there were a couple of parts on it, probably two or three bits, two, two or three just small, small areas where I thought, no, that's really pretty. You know, that's, that's, that's really beautiful. Um, but apart from that, it was all like, <laughs> it was all hedges. It was like all hedges. I was driving and driving and driving for ages and ages. And it was like, I can see nothing but hedges. And I thought, surely the whole thing's not going to be like this. Surely I'm not even on the Ring of Kerry yet. But I was. And so, yeah, it was really disappointing. I was really, I was really a bit miffed really <laughs> about the fact that because once you're on it once you're on the ring of Kerry you kind of have to keep going um because it's as far one way as the other if you know what I mean so so yeah I was driving and driving and driving and uh and I was getting a bit more pissed off basically the further I was driving and uh and I just thought you know there are some much be much more beautiful um, parts of Ireland than the Ring of Kerry and uh, yeah so I was um, yeah I wasn't very happy <laughs> um, as I said don't get me wrong there were some really beautiful parts to it but there was not there was, it was like there was no atmosphere <laughs> does that sound really strange like there was no personality <laughs> you know what I mean it was like I literally just kept driving kept driving going I just have to get to the end I just have to get to the end you know and most of the time whenever I'm driving um here I love it I love every part I'm looking around me and I'm thinking oh wow you know that's really interesting or whatever but no not the ring of carry I was really bored <laughs> and uh yeah I just couldn't wait to get to the end of it so anyway, that was that. And then I decided, okay, so I will go and do, I, could, I needed to find somewhere to park as well. So I was, I was getting a bit kind of worked up a little bit about, you know, where am I going to park? There was certainly nowhere on the Ring of Kerry that I wanted to park. And um, yeah, so I went to Dingle. <laughs> So Dingle is on another peninsula. I'll, I can show you on the map in a minute or two. Um, 
So it was like I drove all the way around the Ring of Kerry and then I drove all the way around this other peninsula. Hello Sienna Choppers. Hello my darling. <laughs> yes, we had a, a shut up big day in the van van yesterday, didn't we? Oh dear. And um, yeah, I mean, I was I was kind of conscious that I, I could hardly even let, you know, Sienna and Phantom out for, for a walk or anything either because you're just like stuck on this road. But anyway. Oh, oh cuddles. <laughs> um, so yeah, we got to Dingle then and there was nowhere to park. <laughs> and that was quite tough I think I think because I was fed up I really just wanted to stop somewhere and uh, you know get get stuck into doing some work online and things like that and I couldn't I couldn't do anything so so yeah I was, it was a bit of a bit of a grumpy day <laughs> um, and then <laughs> then we stopped at this beach we found a beach and um, it was beautiful, absolutely beautiful beach. And um, we went for a bit of a walk. And then, uh, like I had, I don't know, like there were signs up to say that no dogs were allowed on the beach until after seven o'clock in the evening. And it was like eight o'clock, it was 8 p.m. And I was walking um, the hooligans on the beach. And I had a few people kind of, you know, say, oh, they're not allowed on the beach. <laughs> I know, yeah. <laughs> We're not allowed on the beach and all this sort of stuff. So, so yeah, I was grumpy. Martha, didn't I have a grumpy day? Didn't I? Oh dear. But anyway, <laughs> thankfully, um, I did actually find um, a really beautiful spot. So, because I was so grumpy, <laughs> um, I uh, I left this big beach. Place. and I just I just started driving around and I got to this part where I felt like it was literally the, like the end of the world I uh, I drove around these cliffs and wow I was like oh my god if you get like one you know one little wrong turn and you'd be in the middle of the ocean you know um, the roads were so narrow <laughs> And it was double, you know, traffic coming the other way as well. And I'm like, oh my God, you know. Um, and at one point, <laughs> I think there was there was two of us on the road. And like, there was no way I was pulling up at the, at the side. Because I was like at the cliff head, edge side. And, uh, and so I sat. <laughs> I sat there waiting for the car who was on the inside part, on the safer part. To kind of pull over a little bit so they didn't move and I didn't move so we were like <laughs> um, so yeah <laughs> it was kind of a strange day um, but anyway we drew I drove on round and I find um, this really beautiful spot it had a tiny tiny little cove beach and um, I can't even remember what it was called It'll be on my map um, and yeah so we stayed there and so in the end <laughs> in the end it was a great kind of spot and I kind of thought oh well you know um, <laughs> I was just meant to move on and it was, it was so funny and while I was driving along these cliff paths whatever there was like a herd of about 200 sheep just appeared from nowhere in the middle of the road and I, I was laughing and laughing at this point because I just thought I've had such a grumpy old day and uh, and I just felt like you know that this had just been sent to make me laugh and it did so so after that I was fine and we found our beautiful spot and these hooligans were able to kind of go for a for a runabout on the beach and all that kind of stuff so it was all good so anyway I'm now at Banna Strand and it's huge it's a massive massive beach um, it's really busy as well I can turn this round and if you can see out my dirty window <laughs> there's loads and loads and loads and loads of cars here 
it's actually a lot quieter than it was earlier but uh, but yeah it's really it's a beautiful beach it's massive I'll, uh, I'll go out and do a bit of a, a video out there at some point um, before I leave but here we are I'm now sitting trying to get myself back up to date with my online that was phantom <laughs> with my online earning stuff and I I need to do quite a lot of stuff really because I haven't been able to get online the past couple of days so um, I'm going to start with my ad clicks so I haven't done my ad clicks for for a few days so if I turn my screen around let's see. You can see my laptop. Oh, you can see a reflection of me. <laughs> so yeah, I'm on Neobox. And um, just trying to do my ad clicks. So Neobox, Scarlet Clicks, and Get Page Planet, Optimal Box. So those are the four um, PTC sites that I'm doing. And I'm still sorry, I have to show you a look at this face. He's out for the count. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm trying to do my ad clicks. And every time I do my clicks, is it actually going to work? I've tried to do them about four or five times now. And and they're not doing they're not <laughs> I, I, it's taken me about four or five attempts to do each click, so it's a bit of a pain in the backside. <laughs> Good job in about I'm in a better mood today. Um, so yeah, I'm doing that. And uh, if I can go on to Scarlet Clicks, it's the one. Let me see if I can get onto the account. It's the main one at the minute. Um, where are we? So, yes, I have on Scarlet Clicks, I have 246 rented referrals and I have earned, can you see? Aha, there we go. So I have, um, I've just done my um, uh, purchase balance. I moved it over into my main balance and um, did some extending and stuff. So that's my... Uh, Scarlet Clicks account at the minute. My earned balance, $1,886 on there, um, which is great. I have also received, where are we, just over $200, which I have withdrawn. But the main thing, if I go to my rented referrals section, the main thing about this account is that it is almost ready um can you see here so i have some on like eight days nine days whatever but if i go down Sienna. <laughs> so yeah here we go um i've got Most of them now are on 80 days and over. So I'm on probably, what's that? Mm, maybe about 40 more just to extend on there. And once I do that, then I will have, uh, I'll be able to withdraw for probably about 50 days in a row, which is fantastic. And as you can see, I've just changed the expires um, changed it round so I have the majority of them so yeah nah. <laughs> um, the majority of them are over you know, well 300 days or you know pretty close to it like I have let me see if I go to page 4 so those ones are on like a hundred days. I'll go to page three. <laughs> Thank you, Sienna. Um, so yeah, 
I have this is on page three. The majority of them, as you can see there, are on over 200 days. So I'm really, really to having that account really well sorted out. Um, and it's going to kind of be my main, um, my main piece, my main PTC account, which is probably going to be used um, to fund some of the other ones to get them all to the point where I can withdraw from them every every week. Some of them I can withdraw from every three days. So uh, so yeah, that is really good. I'm really really pleased with that. Um, especially because I'm on the road now and if I'm going to be doing my six month tour thing sorry I'm just trying to keep doing ad clicks while talking to you um, so if I'm going to keep doing uh, my tour around Ireland if I'm going to be on the road for like six months um, I would like to have a plan in place for paying for my petrol basically so I'm probably going to use my PTC sites to um, uh, to create a, 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 a constant flow of income, basically. So the plan with that is, if I have, for example, probably about $20 per week that I can bring out of my PTC sites, and uh, I'll be able to use that to pay for automated traffic and the automatic traffic then will start to make um, daily affiliate sales for me again. So that's the plan with those. So I'm pretty excited about that, to be honest. Um, and uh, yeah, so I, uh, I've got lots of things I need to kind of really get into place now. Like I've been traveling around for about three weeks at the minute. And there's been all sorts of different things have been happening. Um, I have had quite an issue with my charging the laptop, charging the phone. Um, I have to like charge up my cool box and stuff like that as well. And I've only got one battery, so I definitely need to buy another battery. And um, there's other things I need to sort out as well. Um, I have a bit of a problem with the van. Um, leaking water out of the, uh, not the not the engine part of the, of the van, but whenever you put put water into the camper van for you know for your taps and stuff, um, I've got leak uh, for that. So I need to do things like that. So at the minute, um, I'm probably going to be away from home for another four or five days. I would think. Um, I'll be going back home in a few days, sorting out some more of the things that I need. I'm going to buy my new battery. Um, I need to, I was just underneath the van and there's a problem underneath there as well. My exhaust, the, the little rubber things that hold the exhaust in place are all kind of coming apart. So I had to tie up my exhaust earlier as well. So, uh, so yeah, there's lots and lots of things going on at the minute. Um, but I still can't wait actually to be on the road properly, you know, for like six months. <laughs> I'm really excited about it. And uh, I just need to get my online earning stuff all sorted out so that it's a lot more automated and uh, I had started doing some of that, but I definitely need to do a lot more. Okay, well, I suppose that's it, really. I've been chatting for nearly 20 minutes, according to the timer on my phone. And, oh yes, I was going to show you on the map where I am, wasn't I? So, if I turn it around. So, yes, over here, Ring of Kerry. I drove all the way. All the way round here, right the way up here, and then I did right up here, and I ended up parked like right over at the very edge here somewhere. So yes, it was 
it was quite a it was quite a horrible drive um yeah personally i think the dingle peninsula is a lot more interesting than the ring of Kerry peninsula might be that's just me